Hello everyone and welcome back to Lightscape Odyssey. So as you can see after one year I am starting to re-upload on this particular channel of mine and I've rebranded the channel as well. So it's it was it used to be the by the name Light Sandro TV and I've changed it to Lightscape Odyssey. So this will be like my new channel brand name for the near foreseeable future. And I've rebranded my Bengali channel also and I think a lot of you must be aware it's uh, no longer a TV Bangla, it's Calcutta Light to Wave. So I remember a year back I gave a review of this watch which I'm still using and uh, after one year if you ask my review it's working pretty fine as opposed to the bands that I've used, MI bands, uh, they uh, you know they don't charge properly a lot so Overall, I think that watches are a more preferable option as compared to bands. Anyway, this video is not about that. So, I'm going to do an unboxing and review of this vintage radio styled speaker that I've bought recently. So, this speaker is available on many uh, different platforms like Flipkart, and, uh, Amazon, I think Misho also. I but I did bought it from my local store. I did not buy it online. I bought it from my local store. But I will share the links uh, where you can buy like the exact same speaker. So the brand here is OUD. You get a lot of different brands. Okay, uh, there is a popular brand called Amtech, I think so, which is which costs a little higher. I think uh, something around uh, one thousand or eleven hundred. But apparently that. Uh, of that brand the sound quality is good this is a cheaper one it's it costed 480 for me i'll see what is the minimum price uh, that i get online i will post the disc, uh, link in the description so so inside this one there is another box there used to be a bubble wrap also i removed the bubble wrap because i have been using this uh, radio you can see for quite some time I'm doing a re-boxing and then re-unboxing for the video and then there's an instruction manual okay so I'll go into the details later first let me show the video okay so this is how it looks now since I bought it from an offline store the color has faded a little okay but overall I think it's uh, pretty new because there's a sticker and uh, the speaker inside is also shining quite well so we have a USB port uh, this is the on off button this is the volume regulator here we have a headphone jack sorry for the blur uh, we have a TF card or SD card micro SD card or what we popularly call as memory card or reader or slot and here is a B type charger so it uh, this supports B type charger okay not A type or C type okay and we have the radio antenna here and uh, the battery here so it's a surprise this is the most surprising thing that this is actually a rechargeable lithium ion battery but usually batteries are always built in okay they are not removable here you can remove okay it's a bit tight yeah so here as you can see it is removable so in case I face any issue with the battery in the future maybe the battery is running out um, because in these kind of uh, you know devices I have used you know Walkmans, MP3 players and speakers the battery uh, like uh, beyond a period of time I don't think the you know the battery capacity stays the same so let's see how long the antenna is Okay. So it's not very long, but I think it's good enough to capture the, you know, the stations. So let's hear and see how the you know, radio is. So when you switch it on, it automatically goes into the Bluetooth mode. And uh, to switch to radio mode, you have to press this first button, which is the mode button. So it's tuned into 1040 which is a fever FM here in Calcutta. The volume is set at minimum so I'll just increase the volume a little. Anyway, I'll 
probably get a copyright <laughs> from this so so yeah that was uh, about the aesthetic now a lot of people might uh, not prefer this kind of radio because they want a modern design something new something that resonates with their personality of the time period but for me i have actually been uh, you know uh, searching for these kind of you know vintage style radios because because of the antenna specifically uh, they can capture the radio stations um, you know very strongly as opposed to speakers when i have used uh, you know some other bluetooth speakers when i have to plug in either the aux cable or the charging cable and then tune into the radio but even then you know there were a lot of disturbances i another thing which i have been doing is plugging a speaker with an aux cord with my phone with uh, yeah with my phone and then turning on the radio on my phone but there were still some stations which were not um, you know i was not getting the reception properly so in this radio uh, what i was imagining would be that uh, all the stations would be you know i'll get proper reception and that has been you know the case that has been true to the case there is uh, some i would say like uh, you know uh, background noise if i'm putting it too much like you know too far away corner but even that is adjustable and especially if you place it on near your windows or balcony or maybe in the center of the room with all the windows open it gets very good reception now coming to the sound quality part you have already heard the sound quality however here i have some comments okay first of all the price as i said this costed 480 rupees and it's available in flipkart and amazon also in uh, like it starts in that range and then it goes higher so i'm assuming that the higher it goes the sound quality improves but even so 480 i would still say that uh, the cost could have been more economical why i feel the sound quality is not excellent i would say okay it's okay it's average it's not too bad because i have used you know those cylindrical speakers where the the lamp type of speakers it glows in different colors and uh, you know on the top side that is this uh, the speaker is there i think i have it like deep inside i'll show it sometime but those speakers sound quality is just terrible okay just terrible <laughs> it literally uh, feels like you have you know phone called someone and you are getting uh, you're getting to hear that sound from you know over the phone it's that bad and i think it costed like my sister bought it one in 2017 so that's 7 years back yeah and it costed 270 that time so really that is not worth the while uh, this one the quality is better than that however i still feel that i um, you know in this context of sound quality there is a lot of it like there's huge area of improvement here you can uh, you know like uh, increase the volume to get try to get a better sound but overall i feel that they could have done better now one hack that i will give you is if you're using your uh, mm-hmm. smartphone with bluetooth mode there is an i'm not sure if the app is available for ios also but for android we have an app called music wallet so the spelling is m u s i c o l e t music wallet okay that app has different kinds of equalizers okay so i have used that particular app and set the equalizer in soft mode that you know significantly improves the sound quality that you get here so uh, by the way this is not a sponsored video neither music or it nor this radio brand has sponsored me so this is all my experimentation and uh, my honest review so if you download and use music or it and you set the equalizer in soft mode then the sound quality that you get from here it's significantly improved not as good as the ones you'll get from JBL or Bose but uh, you know like much decent quality you will get as opposed to using this uh, just as it is okay so now let's come to the discuss the battery life okay so i have been using it for quite some time 
and as I said, this is me, uh, like decent battery life. So it does not get um, what do I say? It does not run out of battery too soon. It uh, I think only yesterday when I have been using it at a very loud volume for a uh, long duration, like over two hours, then I got a you know warning that the battery is low, and I had been using it previously also, so the battery was already low. And then again, I was using it at a loud volume for more than two hours. So I'll say that the battery uh, battery capacity is decent. Okay. So yeah. Now I think the most important uh, what do I say drawback <laughs> about the speaker is that it does mention uh, that it supports devices with audio input. You can access your computer, MP3, mobile phone, and other audio output device this is actually uh, i think so is the wrong information because i've done a lot of research and i found out that uh, the headphone jack is only an output jack it does not uh, you cannot use the speaker with uh, you know as an input device via an aux cable so you cannot plug in an aux cable in the speaker and connect it with your computer or your ipod or anything and use it so this is one big drawback that I would say because I use aux mode quite often because I have a lot of you know old style mp3 players and computers which does not always support bluetooth plus the fact that aux mode greatly increases the battery capacity this I have personal experience because I've used a lot of speakers you know um, bluetooth drains the battery very fast even direct fm direct uh, tf card they drain the battery very fast and especially bluetooth aux cable on the other hand i think there have been times where i have you where I've kept the speaker on for more than six hours and it's played like very smoothly so this is one big drawback i will still go for some more experimentation because uh, just because the instruction manual says that there is an aux uh, you know an aux facility but uh, i've done a lot of research i watched a lot of other videos also and so far that i know that it does not support an aux input okay so let's just measure the pros and cons i would say pros i will say is aesthetic design okay for me personally uh, it gives a very cute vintage type of vintage radio style design so i like the design Okay, number two will be battery capacity. Okay, I can rely on the battery without it running out of battery every now and then. Okay. Um, third will be the antenna. Okay, so the built-in radio antenna gives excellent radio reception. Okay, so this will be my third pros. Fourth, I might say this strap that uh, that has come included. So you can you know just keep it hanging uh, if you're going for a shower you can keep it hanging above somewhere or just anywhere in the house I will say uh, fifth will be these interactive buttons so if you're using radio mode each of these buttons are for uh, you know different stations so you can instantly you know switch from station 1 to station 9 without having to go through all of the stations in between uh, sixth will be the small LED screen which displays which current mode it is in and uh, which station it is tuned into. Okay. And uh, seventh, I will say that it has come with a, a B type charger, though C type chargers are more uh, popular nowadays, but at least it's not mini USB or A type chargers, you know, the very old ones which still come in, you know, uh, old MP3 players and iPods because uh, those uh, cables you can't find anywhere so in case it had an a-type charger and over a period of time the charging cord would stop working that would have been a big problem so b-type charger i have a lot of b-type chargers at home so that is good but uh, i think c-type chargers are faster and more popular nowadays okay and uh, the other modes uh, usb and the SD card mode I will say I don't use them very much especially USB I found that they drain a lot of battery okay sometimes even more than Bluetooth so yeah those are the pros the cons I would say uh, the very big con is aux input okay it does not support an aux input 
as far as I've seen so far. Secondly, the um, audio quality, okay, that I think has a lot of area improvement. Third, I would say the price. I think 480 for this is slightly um, on the higher side. I will say because overall, I have judged this entire product. It should come at something around. 300 350 or 370 380 at most not more than that i don't think so so yeah that's all so i'll give in case uh, you know you are planning to buy this uh to this is also a good gift idea you know you can gift it to your uh, you know a lot of elderly pr uh, people they prefer old style radios so you can give it to them so if you are planning to buy a similar radio to gift or uh, if you like the vintage style you know with a with an antenna and want to use one product for this like you know i'll give the link in the description but uh, the prices do fluctuate so i'll do some research and find out find out that which hotel is selling uh, this video at the lowest price and i will put that link but uh, of course you can do your own research and you know try to find out some other links also so there is uh, another brand called Anket as I discussed in the starting of the video that is slightly on the higher side at I think 1000 or uh, 1100 but I have heard that the sound quality is good but that is only based on what I have heard I haven't personally used it so you can just go ahead and do your own research anyway um, so also I am doing a Q&A video in my Bengali channel Calcutta Lightwave so I am accepting questions I will post the link where you can uh, you know, enter your questions below so you can enter your questions anonymously also you don't have to even you know mention your identity and i will i will be answering them live another thing is that uh, my cousin mary who was previously hosting the channel beauty unloaded has uh, created a new channel called skybound living and she is uploading uh, lifestyle videos very short videos so uh, that will be her new format uh, where she is uploading so i'll share uh, her Okay, sorry, a uh, channel link also in my description and you can go ahead and you know check it out and subscribe also so until next time I'll co I'm coming very soon in my Bengali channel just stay tuned and hope to see you all very soon bye